best blooper ever. Ever. <laughs> Make sure you watch to the end. See Candace singing. Jason. Okay, we're at an RV park in pretty much where we was. We're in, where, what was it called? Chloe, please. Pilot Knob. Pilot Knob. We are in Pilot Knob, California, literally right next to Yuma. But um, our actually crapper's full, and we have to do laundry. It's like overflowing. We like never usually have this much laundry, but we've got like a lot there, and then we've got this bag here, and then Annie just got a bath, and then she's gonna do sheets. So. So we're going to do an RV park. Is it the cheapest to do it this way? Probably not. For us, RVing, as long as we've been RVing, it's not always about the cheapest way to do things. Sometimes it's just convenience. And this is very convenient for us. I mean, we could have, I could have probably found somewhere pretty cheap to dump the tanks and then I could, she could have just went to a laundromat in town. but. The laundry here is within walking distance of the RV. It's like literally 20, 30 feet from the RV. So it's just easy. Also, we'll be uploading this video with some Nomad internet. If you guys need some high speed mobile Wi-Fi, completely unlimited. There's a link in the video description below. We needed to dump the tanks anyway, and I needed to flush them real good because we've been in court site for like three and a half months. And usually there's people waiting behind you. So I, I, some people will sit there and flush out their tanks, but I like to just dump it and go. You know, there's people waiting. It doesn't have to be flushed real good every single time, but it's something you should do every so often, mainly to just keep your sensors and stuff fairly clean so they're working. But yeah, that's what we're doing. <laughs> I'm gonna let Candace get back to work. Yeah. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed the video of her singing. <laughs> That's not funny. You're not posting that. It was pretty funny, and I am posting it. <laughs> Jason, seriously. Seriously. <laughs> what do you think, Annie? Should we post it? Was it good? Chloe don't care. Chloe's still waiting for more food. <coughs> Chloe, I'm not giving you more food. <coughs> eat, look, eat this first. Look, look. Eat that, and I might give you some more, okay? It doesn't need to be full. No. All right, guys, we finished up at the RV park. Candace got all the laundry done. We came back out to the long-term area here for at least probably a few more days, something like that. Candace is in here cleaning. Doing her womanly duties. Yeah. <laughs> Annie, what are you barking at? Get yeah, our plan is to head for Texas. It has been for a while. We're going to Texas to do some things that we've wanted to do for a while. But even where we was going, deep down in the heart of Texas, they was hit with that. <laughs> the stars at night are big and bright. <laughs> they was hit with that winter storm so we're just kind of waiting a little while just to make sure that winter is gone because you never know i mean they could get something like that again in the middle of march you just never know you know it could be a long winter i don't know what the groundhog said what do you say i don't remember <laughs> i don't know but we're just waiting a little bit longer we're not in any big hurry we have to be in Missouri the end of April mm -hmm. for doctor's appointments and dentists, things like that. And then other than that, we really have no plans. But 
our plan was to kind of do a little time in Texas because it's usually warm in Southern Texas and do some things down there until it's warm enough to shoot up into Missouri and get all that done. But like I said, we're in no hurry. So we're going to wait and make sure temperatures are in the seventies where we're going in Texas. There's really nowhere for us to stop on the way. It's pretty much a straight shot besides, you know, a night camping here and there. There's not a whole lot we want to do down I-10. We've pretty much done everything we well we probably haven't done everything we wanted to do but not much is going to be open in new mexico so we're going to probably shoot through new mexico we've done roswell we've done carlsbad caverns down that way so yeah we just want to make sure it's warm enough in texas because once we head to where we're going it's probably only going to take us two or three days because i don't mind driving i'll put in some hours to get some more fun mm -hmm. so <laughs> Just keep watching, guys. Stay tuned. We will be leaving soon. If you are in the area, feel free to stop by during the day and say hi. Anyway, we'll see you guys again very soon. Leave a comment below. Give us a big thumbs up if you like the video. And thanks for watching. Hey, Chloe. Chloe, you going to say hi? Okay. Chloe's sleeping. She got up and cussed while we drove to the back to here. It's only a few blocks. Huh, did I disturb your slumber? Huh? Oh, I know. I know. A what time? Yay, old time. Really? Oh, shut up! <laughs> <laughs> uh, so funny. She did not know I was filming at all. <laughs> <laughs>